But for those with holiday plans just around here in general, all these weeks of rain have now had an impact that extend well beyond the weekend. Our Nicole Nielsen explains tonight that is ruining a lot of holiday plans. I wasn't expecting the water to be this high. A rainy past few weeks have washed away the dreams of many North Texans wanting to spend their Memorial Day weekend lakeside. I was planning to be out here at the lake all weekend long. Now I guess I'm going to be uh, grilling in the backyard. One group of friends coming all the way to Joe Pool Lake from Florida, only to find out the water is almost five and a half feet higher than normal. I came from Miami just to this, so I'm very disappointed. Similar sights can be seen across the Metroplex here at Lake Louisville. This sidewalk at Lake Park is completely underwater. Some parking is going to be limited. Some boat ramps are going to be closed. And unfortunately, some camp site reservations are probably going to be canceled. Louisville Emergency Management has temporarily closed the park. It's run by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, who tell us it could be a few weeks to a month before it may reopen, as Lake Louisville is four feet above normal operating conditions. Others in the area, such as Grapevine Lake, is over seven and a half feet higher than usual, and Benbrook Lake over 10. Folks over there feel overwhelmed as most of their parks and campgrounds have been closed. Man, it just started raining again. Uh... So we'll probably, hopefully, because it didn't rain that much, the water won't rise anymore. But despite the levels, park rangers know there will be some who decide to take their chances on the water. They remind you that in this case, what you don't know can hurt you. Now, whether it's even a simple picnic table that might be flooded, you're walking around fire rings, you're walking around things that, again, are designed to be visual and, and to be avoided and they're now underwater. In Louisville, Nicole Nielsen, CBS 11 News. And you gotta be careful. Engineers, by the way, can only decrease the water level at Benbrook Lake by about a foot a week. And with that in mind, they have a goal to open parks and campgrounds there, hopefully by the 4th of July.